very excited. I think this is a fantastic uh, day for Windsor. It's a fantastic day for National Airlines. We are here to help Windsor celebrate the start of new service to South Florida, specifically Orlando. We believe that we provide the type of service that the Windsor community has been looking for and really kind of begging for for a long time. No longer have to drive across the bridge or take that long slog to uh, Toronto. We're happy to uh, be able to provide direct, high-quality service to South Florida. I think our, our load factors are looking very good for the start of the service. Uh, we have uh, many flights that are already sold out. I think there's been quite a bit of, of demand that has been for a long time asking for this type of service and they're so happy to, to have it. I think they're booking in, in large quantities. It's been great. We would like to begin our voting process by offering two for courtesies to those passengers traveling that require a and you, can you confirm again how much a flight would cost to Orlando? Around, obviously, changes. Well, it, it's somewhere in the $190 range. That's including all the fees and taxes that, that are required. And we have two different classes of service. We have the National Select, which is slightly higher, and we also have the uh, regular economy service. That I think you'll find the seats in the, our economy section are a little bit wider and uh, more spacious than those in some of our competitors. Flights are very reasonable, but it's not just uh, about cheap fares and national. It's really about the quality of your service, and I think anyone who had a chance to go sit on a plane knows what they're getting. Uh, Luggage is included, so you're not being nickel and dime. When you look at the cost and, and the convenience factor as well, I mean, I think uh, traveling uh, even over to Detroit Metro Airport, uh, I mean, you have to pay tolls uh, across the bridge. You're paying twenty dollars a day to park. You're often paying for luggage and all those additional amenities. We used to have one airline operating at this airport. Now you can see the counters are getting full. We're actually talking about counter room expansion because uh, because of the work that's happening here. So from the airport perspective, we think this is uh, it's very very positive. But from the perspective of the people in this area, I think having the addition of uh, direct service from Windsor to Orlando Airport, uh, with National Airlines twice weekly service on Thursdays and Sundays, I think it's very very positive. And I think the people in this community are going to pick up on this service uh, very quickly, and it's going to be a very successful very successful venture. We hope so. Oh, it's perfect. I can't remember the last time I flew direct to Florida. I fly home so often, and I've, I'm always either flying out of Detroit or Buffalo or somewhere, you know. And this way, you know, I got to go to Windsor, and I get to see my grandparents and my family because it's my hometown, and I got to fly direct, and it was perfect.